Ready? Yep. Okay, so here's the deal. What I'm going to show you over here, it's how to build your template and then take your template, put it on the film, and cut the film based on the template and then finish it on the car. Okay? Yep. So the first thing that I want to do is I want to make sure the glass is wet to hold my template film. I'm going to get my template film, bring it to the car, and I can cut this here on the car or I can cut it on the board, okay? Whatever you feel more comfortable doing. I'm going to cut right over here. Okay? So I'm just going to cut enough to cover the glass. I want to make sure this film is anchored when I do this because I do not want this film to be moving on me. So I'm just going to anchor it. And I can do this two ways. I can use my marker. If you don't feel comfortable using the blade on the customer's car, you can use the marker to mark this template and then cut it over here on the board. Or you can cut it over here if you feel comfortable with. I feel comfortable enough to do this. What I want to make sure here is that I have the size of the visible part of the glass covered by this template, okay? Once, once this template, my three sides are cut exactly where the molding ends, and that's why I'm, I'm saying the size of the visible part of the glass. We know there is more glass inside of the channels, but we can't see, so we're gonna stay right here. Now I am going to put this film down. So I can finish the top. Okay, now what I have here, it's exactly the size of the visible part of the glass. Now I can come to the board and I already know that I need about 35 inches of film. I measure from there to here. I need 34, 35. <clears throat> so I'm going to put my film on the board. I want to bring this film to a comfortable position for me to work with. And that's about as high as I want. I'm going to get my film wet so that I can stick this template to it. Now I'll put the template right on it. And I want to follow this line already so that if it's one last line for me to cut. Because I want this little edge over here to go behind the seal or the, the bottom sweep, okay? Now I have that line over there to follow. I have this line to follow and that line to follow. Here's what I want to do. I want to finish this line and this line I can finish over here on the board. I can either do a freehand cut or I can follow the straight edge. If I follow the straight edge, I will do a better job. So I'm going to follow this straight edge. And you notice that I didn't cut right on the line. You see how much I cut beyond the line? Yep. I want you to remember that. It's because I want this line to disappear inside of the channel. Sure. And that's why I cut that much. Usually my rule of thumb, it's about a quarter of an inch. Okay. In each side. Now that I have these two edges, I want to make sure I know where this film is going to go over there. So here's what I'm going to do on this side, okay? I am going to do a little notch over here, and then I'm going to take the excess off. Then I'm going to do the same thing over here. If you want to show over here, here's what I'm going to do. 
I built a guide for me here, and now I'm going to build another guide for me over here. And this is nothing more than a reminder for me where the edge of the glass will be. Because here's what's going to happen now. If I didn't make these marks over here, I wouldn't know where to stop when I go back to do this next step. You can step this side over here now and let me show you this. I'm going to bring this back to the glass and I'm going to use those little marks that I made to tell me where the edge of the glass is. You see, I'm right there and I'm right here. Yeah. That's what this is for. And then what I have to do now, it's do the final trim. Right, now good. I'll bring this film back to the board just to do the final quarters. I'll use my finger, the tip of my fingers, to do that round. I'll do it round here. And over here I'm just going to cut straight. I just want to get rid of the, the two edges. This film is ready to be installed. Wow. Perfect. Good? Nice. You can cut. Can I take a picture? Nice.